Hey, looks like Kondo and the others have turned over a new leaf. They're doing a fine job now, sorting out the regiments. It's incredible how many skilled fighters we've managed to assemble. Now it's up to me to figure out how best to make use of them. Anyways, it's about time we set out for Kyoto. Are you ready? Then let's get going. Bound for Kyoto to protect the Shogun, the Roshigumi leaves Edo, its ranks swelled by a full complement of fierce fighters. Meanwhile, the anti-Shogunate forces also depart Edo for the capital, looking to steal a march on their mortal enemy. I'm afraid we ain't budging! How dare you demand a toll? The Choshu clan has urgent business with the Imperial Court. Let us part! We couldn't care less what business you have. If you want to go to Kyoto, you'll have to cough a little something up first. for our boys combined, hey? Huh. Wait till the nobles try to get through here. We're about to be rich. <laughs> Seems a bunch of ruffians have taken over the checkpoint. They'll let folks pass in the evening, but not without paying first. We could try to force our way through, of course, but there's a lot of them. We'd risk losing good men. I heard Genzui and his men have made it to the Ejeri post, too. This could be the perfect chance. Listen, the men from Choshu are at the checkpoint as we speak. What say we team up with them and take on those thugs? What? Choshu, you say? The ones plotting against His Excellency? Exactly. If they get wiped out too, we kill two birds with one stone. Eh, not bad. I'll go and broach the idea. You'd best come with me. What can I say? I'm a genius, right? You don't get it, do you? I'm trying to make Yenzui and the others realize that not everyone on the Shogun side is a bad egg. This is going to work. You'll see. So it's you, is it? It's been a while? Come on, tell me what you're up to. Well, to cut a long story short, we've joined the Roshigumi. But we're stuck here, thanks to those ruffians. I get the feeling we're all facing the same problem. So, how about we team up and teach them a lesson? Kiyokawa, head of the Roshigumi at your service. You must be Kogoro Katsura, master of the Shinto Munenryu. Your reputation precedes you. I would gladly join forces with you. Ah, oh, so you are Hachiro Kyokawa of the Hokushin Ittoryu. But you can't expect me to work with the Shogun's men. Ah, don't be so petty. We're in the same boat. We need all hands on deck.
Exactly. What's the sense in all of us drowning? All right, I hear you. And no, I don't have any better ideas. The last thing I want is to lose men here. Listen, go and round up Shinsoku and Genzui, will you? I wouldn't want to go into battle without them. Shinsoku said he planned to do some sniffing around the local gambling den. And Genzui just had it out himself. We don't want the thugs getting suspicious. This is a job that demands discretion, and that makes you the perfect fit. And worst case, if those two aren't interested in joining us, we all just need to fight this battle with our current numbers. Look at All right. Any ideas for how we should strike? My men are very rough and ready, so I'll order them to attack head on. Objections? If you're striking from the front, we'll sneak around the back and launch a surprise attack. It's probably best we don't all fight shoulder to shoulder. Very well. It's not like we completely trust your men either. You can join forces with whomever you choose. You and Katsura go back a fair way, after all. Now, what do you say we take the fight to those ruffians? Good. Only don't get too cocky. Now, who do you plan on joining? Happy to hear it. We'll be counting on you. It'll be a pleasure working together. I'm glad to be part of this band. Oh. Here, you want to
Keep getting banged up for me.
looking so good. Done out there. Fighting for the Choshu brings out the best in you. No doubt about it. Yeah. You may be a bunch of mutinous rebels, but you know how to fight. I'll give you that. And there I was thinking your men were nothing but toadies and halfwits. But they too have potential, I concede. Hmm. Listen. Now that we dealt with those gangsters, shall we set our differences aside and celebrate? Sounds like a plan. For now, let's drink and make merry. Hmm. You'll be joining us, I take it? <laughs> hmm. You most certainly have. a manly drinking contest. Oh. <coughs> oh, so if you insist, my dear. You are lovable one, aren't you? Oh, you can really drink, can't you? Don't be shy. Drink, drink. Hey, huh? what's an expulsionist doing with the beer? We'll expel the foreigners, but their drinks can remain. Come by. Come by. Don't forget me. Come by. Looks like I'm up next. Give us a good one. All right. Well, I'd have expected your Roshigumi to be here by now. Patience. You're too anxious. The Roshigumi are on their way to Kyoto, I assure you. What happens next is anyone's guess. Nothing. We both know your real goal is to weaken the Shogunate from within. Perhaps. But what to do with all those fine warriors? Their skills could be useful in a number of ways. In any case, it depends on the course you decide to take. We await a favorable response. The culture this nation still calls its own is worthy of admiration. If only I could say the same for all of its people. A real shame. Shigumi ahead of him offering their protection. The Shogun, Yoshinobu Tokugawa, safely arrives in Kyoto. However, the capital is a hotbed of insurrection, as rival samurai jostle for position and pursue their respective goals.
Sir, there are some awful rumors going around. They're saying Hachiro's been killed, and he was secretly involved with the anti-shogunate faction. I am sorry to say, but it's all true. His body was found in the city last night. No! He's dead? It can't be. There was a message to the Kyoto rebels in his pocket. He was trying to sell the Roshigumi services to the highest bidder. Hachiro, of all people, with the anti-shogun a bunch. That snake. Do we know who took him out? Not yet. Which makes me think, whoever was helping Kyokawa communicate with the other side could in fact be a member of our outfit. Now that I recall, wasn't it Kyokawa who brought you both into the Roshigumi? Say that again! You think I could be mixed up with the anti-shogunate scum? Look, Kondo is not the only one to have started questioning his comrades' loyalties. Everyone's getting a bit jumpy, as I feared they would. If we stay in Kyoto, this could very well tear us apart. Which is why the Shogun has ordered us back to Edo. Right now? I can't get on board with sudden orders like that. The rebels have infiltrated us, and you want us to leave as if nothing's happened. Shouldn't it be our top priority to protect His Excellency while he's in Kyoto? No, we would only be putting his life in danger. Imagine letting a traitor get close to the Shogun. The shame that would bring. I'll summon the entire outfit before long. In the meantime, try to calm yourself. You each need to have a good think about a proper course of action. <laughs>